You ready to earn your Power Query swagger? You gonna get it tonight. What I'm gonna show you is smoother than a top shelf bourbon at two o'clock in the morning. Because guess what? That clock behind me says it is 2.10 a.m. And here is some good bourbon. Let me show you this and then I'm gonna go to bed. Check out this data. It's showing us Erica Andrews, room 317 is signed up for breakfast on Monday. But also Denise Johnson and Vince Fielder Wednesday for breakfast, we've got Florida men, room 931. We want to split these rows and get this data in such a way that we can sort this by the last name, by the meal, maybe get all of the breakfasts together, but with all of the people on their own rows. Maybe we want to sort this by the room numbers. We can't do that now. One way to do this would be to Split this up into different pieces, three different pieces, unpivot them, and then use joins to put them back together. It would work. But I'm going to show you something smooth. Oh. Curse in the data set. Data. And you know it from table slash range. Okay, table does have headers. I got to deal with a couple of things. I'm going to get rid of this change type step. I want to turn this column into text because that 804 is showing up as a number. We're not doing math on those numbers. Close these holes. Fill down. Add column. Custom column. Call this F name. We're going to use the function text dot split. Open parentheses. We want to split first name, comma, split it by what? By the semicolon, and that has to be in double quotes. Double quotes. Close parentheses. OK. Now it has split each of those names and put them in a list. Let's click on this. All right, Erica, Denise, Vince. Good. Now we got to do this two more times. Let's check. Right, the rooms are split. Now let's get rid of the columns we don't need. Right click, remove, right click, remove, right click, remove. Now to turn these columns into a table, custom column, table dot from column, open parentheses. Now I'm gonna make a list of lists and I need the curly brackets. Double click first name, comma, last name, comma, room. Close the curly brackets, close the parentheses. Okay, got to get rid of this table here. Delete, enter. All right, let's look at it. Here is the table for breakfast on Monday beautiful now we can get rid of the list highlight here I'm gonna hold on the shift key go to room one right click remove columns now here is when we know we did something smooth expand I don't want to use this and okay Man. Erica Andrews 317 Narcisse Patel 1111 is joining us for breakfast on Tuesday. Now, wasn't that smooth? You now have Power Query Swagger. <laughs>